Welcome to the rendering overview tutorial for Keyshot 4. As a CPU based real time ray tracing application, Keyshot is not dependent on the graphics card for rendering calculations. This means that as you make changes to your materials, lighting, and camera, your image dynamically updates in real time, with the image quality improving as you let it res up. If you'd like to quickly save out the real-time image, simply click the Screenshot button and it will be saved to your Keyshot 4 renderings folder. If you go to Edit, Preferences, General, you can specify the screenshot format and quality. You can also enable settings to ask where to save each screenshot and to save a camera with each screenshot. If we open the Windows Task Manager, we can see that Keyshot very efficiently uses 100% of the CPU's cores. Keyshot is near linear in scale, so as the number of cores increases, the faster the render time will be. So if you're building a machine or looking to upgrade the performance of your existing machine, the number of cores in your CPU will be your area of interest. If we pause Keyshot by pressing Shift P, we can see now that the CPU has been completely freed up to run other applications. This is very useful when working simultaneously between Keyshot, CAD, and photo and video editing applications. These basic rendering principles help make Keyshot the easiest and most powerful rendering tool for you and your 3D data.